Shut up! I'm trying to film a video. Whoa, they listen. They listen. Cool. So, I got back from, where, where, where were we, Michigan City, Indiana? Yeah. And realized I have a ton of footage to go through and edit. So I was going to save this video and uh, get more footage of running this guy here uh, through some trails, but uh, I don't have enough time to crank out the Michigan City race video by my normal post time, which is Wednesday. So I'm doing this, where we took the Gladiator north end of Lake Norman, the Catawba River basically, and we took it back in some of the duck spots, some of the little shallow trails and whatnot, and went cruising and caused some carnage. So, Southern Light LED whip flexes, and it wibble wobbles when you hit a tree, but I guess when you hit a tree past the wibble wobble point, it does this. Gotta get a new one of these guys. Uh, it's a really good light. I'm trying to think if I should get another one of these or the one that goes up here on the gator tail. What do you think? Mm -hmm. Me neither. So yeah, check out the trail ride. For a video, man, come on. Give her some pepper. I did shoot my prop up. It was like a riverbed, so it was nice sandy rocks. Excuse me, Pooh Bear. They want to see the prop. Look at that. I gouged it up pretty nice. So, yeah. You'll have that. You'll see in one part, well, you'll see where we got stuck. And I had to get up on the back of it and -da 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 my way out. And yeah, that's probably what did all this. But it's fine. You go run it through some sand and polish it right back up. And good thing I know some powerboat guys because then we get this, you know, work a prop for the low, low price of a couple thousand dollars. Then we'll go race boat speed. This is just a tiny little snit bit of what this boat's capable of. And. You, know, you jump some beaver dams, some trees. We didn't do anything too crazy in this video. Were you ever scared? No. I didn't think so. You've been through worse on this thing. Back! What a nice dog.
I first started hunting, it used to be really good up here, not a whole lot of people came out here. But now, from all these duck lines that people built years ago are just falling apart and all dilapidated because nobody hunts up here except for all the, the youngsters. And they hunt you know, real close to each other, they hunt the crap out of all these holes so they just get over hunted real fast and it's not worth the hoot anymore. But it is cool to see the, I guess you call it history, of the Lake Norman duck hunting or you know, so the top of the river, up there's the bottom, up there's the bottom. I wish it was still good, but fortunately it's not. Oh well. I feel like I'm on one of those gondola rides or whatever it's called. Shallow. Yeah. It's so good for the prop. And all this sand. Especially that. Yeah, you got... Like, I could hear the suction. Right, it sucked you in. I don't know if the camera could, but... Well, that one just got out. It's soft, but still. That's good for the old bull. Eagles were cool. Mm hmm. Two of them. Am I silly? Yeah, go back. 
Huh? It wasn't done. What? Go back. I turned it on silent. So cool to be able to have a boat. I can get up in here. We way tucked back. She's just staring at the sky. Something bit me.
always complain about missing them. Here you go. A tenth of a mile and we're, you know, sprinkles and clear sky. Well, cloudy, but bright cloudy sky, except for that guy. Yeah. yeah. I'm glad we're not there. I'm That's not. where we were. I like being in the rain. Imagine. Yeah.